In today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to add bleed and crop marks in Adobe Acrobat Pro. This task may sound technical if you're new to it, but I promise with these step-by-step -step instructions, you'll find it straightforward and simple. Bleed and crop marks are crucial for any professional print job, ensuring that the colors and elements extend past the edge of where you want to trim the paper. These marks are vital for making sure your final document looks as polished and professional as possible. First, let's begin by opening a PDF file in Adobe Acrobat Pro. You can do this by launching the application and selecting the PDF file you want to work with. Once your document is open, direct your attention to the left panel. You should find the All Tools tab there. Clicking on this reveals a suite of useful functions Adobe Acrobat Pro has to offer. From the tools available, look for Use Print Production and select it. This tool provides a range of print-specific functions that are essential for preparing documents for professional printing. Within this menu, locate and choose the option called Add Printer Marks. This is where you'll find the settings to apply both bleed and trim marks to your document. Once you're in the printer mark settings, ensure you check the boxes for both trim marks and bleed marks. These checkboxes activate the marks for your print layout, so it's vital to ensure both are selected for a complete setup. Now, let's talk a little bit about customization. Under the style section, you have options for selecting your preferred style and line weight. The style affects the appearance of your marks, and the line weight determines how thick these lines will appear. Adjust these settings to ensure your document meets your print shop specifications or to just suit your personal preference. Moving on to the page range section, here you can decide whether to apply these printer marks to the entire document or just specific pages. You have the flexibility to select all pages, which is typically recommended unless you specifically want these marks on distinct pages. Once you've configured all your desired settings, click on OK. A confirmation dialog box will pop up. Simply click yes to proceed. Following that, you'll encounter another dialog box with a message indicating that printer marks may overlap your artwork. This is just a precautionary note. If you've set your bleeds correctly, this shouldn't be an issue, so click OK to finalize. And there you have it. You've successfully added bleed and crop marks to your PDF using Adobe Acrobat Pro. By following these steps, you're ensuring that your printed documents will meet professional standards, reducing the risk of errors during the actual print process. Thanks for watching and feel free to leave any questions or comments below.